Okay. New week. Last full week of the year. Good evening, morning, afternoon, whatever time it is for you. I am playing more GeoGuessr this week. I am using that GeoBear World someone suggested. And as I've said, if you guys have suggestions for maps or any other games in general you want me to try, uh, let me know. I will 100% do it. This one was labeled as easy. Uh, the one I was doing last week definitely was pretty easy. So we'll see if this is any easier than that one. It's like right now we're just. Oh. That. H Carolinas. I don't know which Carolinas though. So this just says it's uh, going to get rid of most of the things to complain about where it's just random roads in uh, Russia, Brazil. And they also threw in Southwest, just middle of nowheres. So yeah, um, let's take a look. This really seems like a weird place to have a Staples. Like, they, normally there's giant signs for it everywhere. This just seems real tucked away. At the end of a cul-de-sac. So right now, I feel I've got to narrow this down to a Carolinas. And I'll just, like, click there for now. Um, let's hit back. I don't know if I have any other updates or any other things to talk about just yet. Except going through here. Um, weekend is almost over. I am debating whether or not we record all three at once, but Christmas is happening in two days now. So, I probably will. Um, I know that it, at least when I was uh, a kid, this holiday was definitely more of a big deal. I mean, it's kind of an obvious thing to be saying here, but when I got older, I didn't care as much. And granted, also, I started working in a mall during Christmas in a food court. Sounds like that's a Charlotte. Something or other. Oh, Charlotte. Uh, airport Commercial Center. Is there an airport around? I'll just, like, click here. But, yeah, I grew to hate Christmas, hate malls, still do. And, uh, that's never gone away. I mean, last time I was Mecklenburg, that's what the other one is. All right, Charlotte Mecklenburg. Where is Mecklenburg? It should be close to it, shouldn't it? I'm not seeing it anywhere. But still don't like it. It's not so much I care about who gives presents, all that other shit. It's a uh, well, getting together with family. And it's, just, it's interesting how that always ends up being a transition that people have. Is yeah, they'll talk about you know, your family seems to be the important thing. And it, like it or not, it eventually turns into that. And you can roll your eyes and say, Ugh, I'm, I, when I get older, it's not going to be like that. It just happens. I mean, you can actively go out of your way to try to be that person, but then you just kind of turn into an asshole. And, you know, some people are fine with that. More power to if you are. That's a rough road to go down. Be the constant asshole. Believe me, I've tried. It's very rough. I think I got this place. That was just on the other side of next to Billy's Graham Library, full of crackers. Um... Okay, for some reason, I was so used to everything being U.S., I'm like, this is a very strange U.S. place. But it is not, so am I going to see anything here that's going to help me? If this thing was unfurled correctly, maybe I would be able to. Uh, let's just take a quick look at the sign. There's going to be so much information here, but I don't think any of it's of use to me. No, well, I've got the region of the world figured out. It's just a matter of... Batong. Hmm. Oh, no. 
Lucky strikes still exist, huh? How about that? Yeah, Christmas is just now turned into a second Thanksgiving. Now there's just with a little bit more obligation. Instead of having to cook food, now you have to buy people gifts. Although our family has, as of this year, switched over to the uh, pulling a name out of a hat and just getting one gift for a person. And honestly, that's a little better. I mean, there is that level of obligation, and it was a bit annoying to be like, ugh, I gotta buy gifts for everybody. And it's not like I just hate buying gifts, it's just you gotta make sure you get things people want. Do you really bother with gift certificates? Because that's... Just, it's kind of lazy doing gift certificates, but I also understand why people do it. Because they're like, I don't know what you want, I'd rather just give you the means... Uh, for you to be able to get what you want. And you're just like, well, gee, thanks. Dot com. Thank you for not helping me. Am I missing anything here? Like, that's a important sign, but it's not telling me what I need. Okay, I guess I'm going this way. Hmm. Bali. God damn it, where's Bali? Bali. This is just one of those things that I feel like I've seen. It, 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 I feel it's big enough that I should be able to find it. Bali. God damn it. Where are you? Isn't it Indonesia is Bali? Isn't it? Bali's huge, though. Like, Indonesia is large. I'm telling you nothing you don't already know. The hell is Bali? Why can't I find you? Bali. And then Dem... Yeah, okay. I feel I've... I, I got it now. But yeah, now, now it's just basically switched over to just getting gifts for some people. And now, focusing on the rest of the stuff. I mean, I've got to get the gifts for the kids just because that's what you have to do. And, uh... Got all that stuff taken care of. It was super fast, and honestly, it was a little less stressful. Um, I'm not telling other people to do your Christmas however you want. You don't have to do the gifts. Whatever you do to get hang out with whoever you want to. Um, but yeah, the stress level for that, even lower. And yeah, everyone was like, well, there's no stress if you just do it through Amazon. I was like that for a couple of years, and now I'm just kind of... Dialing that back, too? I mean, yeah, a lot of the stuff from Amazon I'll buy for myself, or if I'm, like, doing this exchange that I'm doing with a friend, I'll buy the stuff. And then uh, do it on Amazon that way, because it's going to get shipped across the country. But other than that, I kind of still like going to a place and then getting the stuff. I mean, it's, it's, it's dumb, I understand that. But it's just that, like, same reason I don't like ebooks and I'd rather read a book. It's just that tangible feeling of having the book and reading it. Or it's just the same thing with certain gifts. I feel like I, I'd rather be holding it to know. I mean, that's definitely old fashioned of me. And I understand that other people are just like, well, you're dumb and crazy. But also, this isn't Turkey, is it? This might be Turkey. I feel this is Turkey. Maybe we're, uh, Istanbul, because how many other, unless it's Ankara, I don't know where else this would be. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to go with that for now, until I find something saying otherwise, but that's how I've just kind of turned the holiday stuff to. It's just... Yeah, I hate going to the crowds. You just have to sure you go you go during off times because I don't know what it is with me. For the past like three months, I cannot, regardless of the time I go to bed, I cannot um, sleep past like six a.m. I'll go to bed at midnight, five thirty. I'm always awake. They always talk about how the older you get, the more 
often you're going to wake up in the middle of the night, the less sleep you're going to get, but uh, it's just annoying. Like, I'd like to sleep in more. I kind of feel a bit tired now, but it's just that thing. I don't know how many other people have sleep problems like I did for a long time. Where I would, The best way I had to describe it was just, this is a weird, it's like they took it out of a cliff and threw it on top of some buildings here. This is weird looking. But I just forget how to sleep. And then you play the game of just like, well, you're pissed. It's like 2 a.m. On a Sunday, you got to work in, in, in like five hours. You look at your clock. You said, if I immediately fall asleep now, I'm going to get three hours of sleep. And that's if you immediately fall asleep. But you're too busy being angry about not being able to fall asleep. So nothing ever happens. Actually, there was a road sign there. Was it over here? No, I got, I got side. I'm going to go this way because I got to get down that road real quick to see if I can't see that road intersection. Here we go. Uh, I need, this isn't going to let me get any closer. I'm not seeing city names I thought I would. I'm 100% sure this is Turkey, Turkey, though. I just wish, excuse me, I would find a bit more information. Um, nope. Come on, focus in. Thank you. Um, that's a Turkish flag, so there we go. Maybe this is Ankara. No, we're next to water. Ankara is definitely not next to water. Okay, because if you won't, well, that's not. It could be a bunch of cities across the... Oh, here we go. Istanbul and Ankara is that way. So we are assuming this side of Istanbul. I'm going to say like right there. Maybe there. Oh, that's back. Oh, geez, that's a big flag. Okay. But the sleep thing has been an issue for me. And I'm all, I'm like, I'm just going to take like, give me, give me over. Oh, geez. Oh, we were here. So I was, okay. I mean, it was on the coast. I took a stab. Got the country right, at least. That's all I was worried about. Excuse me. I really would like to find a way to get myself to go back to sleep and sleep longer, but also I, I'm starting to get into that feeling of if I sleep past um, like 8, I feel like I'm wasting the day. I mean, that's a bit ridiculous, but I, it, it's dismissive to be like, when you get older, you'll understand, but it's, it's just that feeling of, oh, I'm awake. It's 9 o'clock. Jesus, half the day is gone now. That's the way I feel. And I... Does that say? It's a Pentecostal church. Okay, that doesn't tell me anything. It would if I actually... Is that a chef? That dolphin's cooking. Something's not right about that. Especially since he doesn't have opposable thumbs. Hmm. Uh, is this... Cuba or Puerto Rico? This could be Puerto Rico. Is this old San Juan? I have been to old San Juan. I feel this is... Or is this Cuba? Why am I having trouble figuring out the difference between a Cuba? Like this sign here. I feel this is at least a district. Um, I need to see a thing if this is Old San Juan, because I have been to Old San Juan. Get me towards the water. I'm going to see. I can't recognize a place here. Um, still not sure. Uh, let's see. Let's see what this truck says. Give me forward just a smidge. Oh, so we're not... This is all you're going to tell me, huh? That's... Okay, that's... Um, Caribbean Islands. The Antilles? Maybe? Oh, Puerto Rico. Okay, so... I just saw that on the side of that building. I have been... 
to this island before. If I can find exactly where we were staying, it may have actually been over here. Because Old San Juan's over here, I believe. Or is it over here more? It's been a while. I believe we were right around here. So I feel we may be like in here. Um, can I get back? Give me, give me here. Thank you. Yeah, on this building here, Unitech, Puerto Rico. I guess I can't. Thank you. I still don't recognize any of this. We when we were there, you know, because that is a. This is an embassy. It's a bank for Aguadilla. No, that is a, um, um, what's the word? Province, maybe? Aguadilla. Aguadilla, isn't that? Yeah, Aguadilla. Oh, damn it. Maybe this isn't San Juan, this might be Aguadilla. We'll find out in five seconds. I'd be mad if I ended up outthinking myself. Because I think this is Puerto Rico. Okay. Good thing I changed it. I'm feeling confident now. This almost feels like the same exact place we were before. Nope. So, talked about the sleep. Is there anything else like the Christmas stuff? Um, Merry Christmas, blah, blah, blah. Because the next video is going to be the day after. When I have to go back to work. And that's another thing that kind of set me in the... Maybe not caring as much. There's no, like... The best way to describe it is like, okay, there was a holiday. And then every other job I've had is like, okay, maybe the day afterwards. Maybe not like... Well, this is Italia. I just don't know where. Not so much like... All the work that I've done. They had the Christmas and the day after Christmas off. but. You also had school the same way, and you're just kind of like relaxed. So you can be like, okay, had that day, have the next day just to relax and enjoy it. And I haven't had that in a while. Drive now. Finally knew street layouts for specific cities in Italy. I still wouldn't know. And it, it even sucks this year, too. Well, Mainly because the mandated, like, presidential decree, whatever you want to call it, to have Monday off before Christmas. It's like, I, I kind of would like to work that day, but I can't. I'm not getting paid for not working it either, so thanks for that. What is this? Are you selling melons in your house? Where in Italy is this? I am, maybe if I go, I can't go that way. Why can't I go that way? Give me, let me stay on this road, thank you. How do you, like, deal with this when you're driving? Do you have to be like this person, and, oh, the train's coming, you gotta pull to the side to let it come through? That would kind of be annoying. Like, traffic jam, train's there, and a car, and you're just like, well, we're both stuck here, we can't do anything about it. So this goes... Italy, the Orient, and Brazil, I'm guessing. I gotta pick. I'll just go with a city. I don't fucking know. There's a lot of cities here. Do I see mountains? I don't know. There's supposed to be, like, clues and stuff. Maybe I'm just clearly not paying attention, but also... Maybe I'm just not searching far enough. Leroy Merlin. Those are two words I would not, like names, I would not expect to be together. Like Jin McCoy. And if you are a Jin McCoy, cool. You have a very, it's like that Skittle commercial being like Korean Scottish. It's a very unusual pairing. At least to me. Come on, tell me, reveal yourself to me. 
I always thought it was weird too of when I was in Macedonia and I saw restaurants there. They didn't really have like Italian restaurants or Mexican restaurants. They just had the same type of food you can eat at home. You can eat at a restaurant. And be just like, well, what's the point? I mean, let's, did I make a guess? Okay, I did. I don't think I saw anything to tell me anything else here. It, it's maybe we're farther south. Can I? We'll just say Naples. Because there's palm trees. Maybe we're farther south. No, it's the exact opposite side of the country. But whatever. One day down. Oh. So, as I said before, excuse me, as I try not to fall asleep on you, because I'm so well rested. Thank you all, folks, for watching and sticking with. If you're going to do the Christmas thing, hey, Merry Christmas, all that stuff. If not, it's another day for you, good for you. We'll come back again on Wednesday for some more of this. But until then, you enjoy yourself. You enjoy the day. I will as well. I can't think of a good thing to rhyme with it, so it doesn't matter. Goodbye.